Hello everyone, in this video I'll be showing you how to burn videos to DVD using Wondershare Unit Converter. In addition to being a robust and efficient video and audio converter with more than a thousand supported formats, Wondershare Unit Converter also has a built-in disc burner that allows you to create Blu-rays and DVDs from your media files. Let's go over step-by-step -step how we can go through and do this process. Step 1 is to launch the program and import our files into the program. And since we're wanting to burn a DVD, we'll go down to the DVD burner section and then we can either drag and drop our files here or select them from here. So I'll select a clip that I want to add to a DVD and it should load quickly into the program. The next step is to pick a DVD template. Wondershare Unit Converter comes with tons of pre-made templates in all sorts of styles that should surely fit whatever your DVD needs to be about. If you wish to further edit your DVD details, you can select this edit button here, and this will load up not only all the templates you have to choose from, but you can also add things like a custom background picture if you have one, or also background music to play while it's in the menu options. Step 3 is to then configure our DVD settings before we burn, so we can set up whether or not we want a menu or no menu, we can select the aspect ratio whether it's standard or widescreen. If you live in a country that requires a certain TV specification, you can set it to NTSC or PAL. And then finally, we can select from different quality presets for the DVD itself. And up here, we can choose to burn it to a DVD folder or an ISO file. So go ahead and select whichever option you need and finally hit the burn button to begin burning whatever media you selected onto your DVD. And once it's complete, you can just say got it or open up the DVD or file you've created to view your newly converted DVD. One last tip is if you go into your preferences and location, underneath save burned folder and ISO files, you can select where you want to save these two by default if you have a specific place you'd like them to go. And that's going to do it for this video guys, I hope you enjoyed. That's how to burn videos to DVD using Wondershare Unit Converter.